I think that Brock striking is the reason that's improving so much is that he can throw a punch so fast. Um, and, and that's one of the tough things to do is be able to throw a real fast punch. And he's been able to do that. And, and I think having guys like Eric Paulson and Greg Nelson work with him, they're, they're getting him to move his head and his body. And With Brock, it's very easy to kind of take this guy who's so athletic and, and fast and, and big and his willingness to learn. That's the one thing that I think is almost the most important attribute about him. Obviously, he has his physical you know, gifts, but his ability to sit down and just say, what, what, how, do I, how do I get better? This camp, our main focus with Eric was striking. Uh, he's, a, he's a unique striker. He's got great kickboxing skills. And so we just kind of let him run the gamut uh, with all the different striking uh, techniques and drills and strategies. And Eric Paulson is basically an encyclopedia of mixed martial arts. I'm going to leave this camp. I'm going to be here all week. He's going to be tired. By Friday, he's going to be tired when we're done. And he is going to be more than ready to go. He's going to be sharper than attack. Speeding his combinations up and putting punches on top of each other. So I can move with them, and then I go and call it out. I go, jab left, right. He goes, boom, boom, boom. You can, you can drop the jab, left hook, right, cross it. Speed and retraction, speed retraction. Getting that hand in and getting it back. Somebody can maybe land two or three on him, but for every one of his, they're, they're going to pay for it. When he hits, he hits hard. His arms are as strong as most people's legs. I'm just hoping that he doesn't miss the pads. Brock's speed, his explosiveness, you know, his ability to hit really hard and do damage with those hands. Oh, wow, this guy's dangerous. You gotta watch out for this guy. I was going flying on half those shots. Brock hits so hard. He's got so much knockout power at the end of his hands. Man, I would not want to be on the other end of that. You could totally tell his hands have changed a lot. Now he's got the footwork, he's got the upper body movement, he's got the fast hands and the fast retraction. My prediction for this fight is that it, it won't go out of the first round. Uh, I think that Brock's striking has gotten so much better, so I don't see this fight lasting more than two minutes, to be truthful. Brock versus Frank Mir ends in the first round due to knockout. Frank Mir is going to be pounded out. That's how it's going to stop.